Welcome back. There aren't many hidden gems in football recruiting, but Iowa State may have just plucked one from Alcester, South Dakota. Blake Peterson hasn't played on any state championship teams, doesn't usually make the highlights on Varsity Sports Live, but that doesn't mean he isn't one of the best players around. Jason Andera has his story. Blake Peterson loves football. He's always loved football. His dad played football at South Dakota State, and he and his brother Brady have always been competitive. He had a chance to play next to his brother a little bit this past season. Their competitive nature definitely shines through. I remember when we were younger, one of us was losing in Madden. We'd just turn it off and say we'll never know who was going to win. Blake is a defensive end for Beersford and has made himself into one of the best players in high school football across the state. He spent the last fall searching for the right fit to fulfill his dream of playing college football. I remember when I was pretty young, my mom, I'd, I'd tell my parents how I wanted to play college football and they'd just tell me it depended on how much I wanted to work. He did the work all right and it sure paid off. He got five different Division I offers to play defensive line. Those offers coming from the University of South Dakota, South Dakota State, Minnesota, Wyoming, and Iowa State. It's definitely a humbling experience just realizing that there's big schools out there that want you there. and It's just, it's pretty cool. Um, Iowa State, they were kind of just out of the blue. Um, last February, all of a sudden, they invited me to a junior day because I previously contacted them a while ago, but then I didn't have any contact with them after that. So about a month later, I went to the game and they offered me, and it was, it was really humbling and just shocking to get that. But his fall was more than just playing football and touring some of the best colleges in the country. So for instance, if you, you all look at my Twitter, you'd think I just had the, the best fall of my life, just going to see all these really cool places, but um. And it was just, it was a pretty hard fall because after my teammate's mom passed away two days later, uh, my grandma was diagnosed with uh, brain cancer and she passed away two days after that. And then it was uh, right before our homecoming game, my grandfather passed away too. So it was a pretty rough fall. Those losses were tough, but he's taken some of the lessons that he's learned from football and translated them to life. You can't quit when the going gets tough. You just always have to work hard and um, you just gotta keep going. And just knowing that God is always there with you, it's just comforting to know that you're never alone and you can do anything. Well, great message from Blake. Here's why so many colleges are in love with Blake Peterson as a football player. He brings a relentless motor and has the measurables to back it up. He attended the Power Riggs Combine last year, put up some big time numbers, which drew attention around the area. By the way, that same combine is this Friday and we'll have complete coverage of the event next week on the show. We're going to take a break, but coming up after the break, it is Trick Shot Tuesday and our Trick Shot extraordinaire, Matt Wilbur, has been knocked off for the first time in a long time. So see how he was beaten. Midco we... Sports Tonight, presented by Avera Orthopedics.